Hi everybody, it's Lynn from Lynn's Crafts Designs. We're back today with another uh, mini album share. Now this one is from a paper collection from Graphic 45 called The Old Curiosity Shop. And it was actually the first paper pad from Graphic 45 that I ever bought. Okay, it also looks like a book. It came with, if if you bought more than just the paper pad, it came with some really thick chipboard accessories. This is a handmade flower. These are handmade flowers also. Paper, the fabric flowers. These stamps were also... Um, part of the paper pad. Here's the inchy. And I love, love that. This is also from the paper collection. That patterned paper is. And I put a glossy coat of glitter on there. Alright, that is a glass lampwork bead. So is that. So is that, and so is that, and so is that. Yeah, this one is a, uh, it's a silver lined bead. It's got silver in the, um, mm -hmm, under the glass, in other words. Okay, that's a glass bead as well. These are all glass beads. And this wooden bead didn't get mouse chewed somehow miraculously okay stamp a key from the paper collection now I'm not gonna keep saying from the paper collection because this is all from the paper collection Pigs fly. Love that. It's got a lot of just ephemera type pieces. Again, this one has a tag in each of the pocket pages. Okay, just some glossy accent. Oh, crackle accents. This one's glossy accents. Once again, this is just glued down to keep the ephemera from falling through. Okay, this is what I was talking about, about the thicker chipboard. It's got low glossy accents. I pretty much did glossy accents or crackle accents on most of the pieces in some way. May have just been around the hole, but I love this. Applying for finishing touches on the hourglass part. Another when pigs fly. Women doing some calisthenics from the day. Okay, this one I glued down a corner on the top edge for, for a pocket instead of on the bottom. Oh, this one has a pocket as well. An eye chart. 
more women doing calisthenics. Okay, another pocket, a tag in the pocket. Call this a tuck spot, just so you can tuck images down behind. I love that dragonfly. Did the crackle accent on the wings and the glossy accents down the middle. All seeing eye with the wallet there. And another little piece of ephemera. Another dragonfly with the crackle accents on the wings, the glossy accents down the body. Butterflies with the crackle accents. Ooh, I love those little eggs. And more butterflies. Now the graphic 45 paper is double sided. This was actually um, on the cover. This piece wasn't, but this is what the cover image was. Okay, crackle accents on the bottle. Little glossy accents on the wheels. On the eyes of the peacock feathers. Again, just with some ephemera. Bills of mortality. <laughs> Crack me up. Come on, there you go. The little chipboard tags again with the uh, crackle accents on them. On the frame and on the wings. Okay, sorry if the air conditioners may be worse. tickets big photo spot and a smaller photo spot right behind the pocket this one has a lot Really let go of my thumb there. And a big photo spot. Photo spot. Well, you can stick them in the pocket. glossy accents on all those bottles glossy accents on that one big photo spot there glossy accent 
that's on the eyeglasses too. Okay, then last page. Background. Glossy accents on the bottles. Okay, then we've got three of the tiny little tickets, ephemera, a stamped apothecary stamp, ephemera, and then places for journaling or pictures. And there we go. I love the back of this. I, I almost wished I would have made the back the front. The back is so pretty. That is just a brown paper sack. Crumpled. And then painted with some different it's like brown acrylic, some Lindy Stamp Gang spray, stuff like that. There we are. I want to thank y'all so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Like everybody's video that you watch. You can subscribe. It's free. And click the bell notification if you want to get notified when my next video is coming. Bye for now.